Hello adventurers, today we will explore character customization in Hytale. We will see the vast possibilities and resources that will be available. Get ready for an incredible journey into the world of avatar customization in this highly anticipated game. But first, don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel and activate the bell so you don't miss any content about Hytale. Although we don't have the game in our hands yet, there is a lot of information that we will be able to explore and learn about when the game launches. Starting with the basics, Hytale offers an impressive diversity of characters. You can choose between male and female avatars, with five skin tones available. Now, let's dive into creating your character's appearance. Hytale gives you extraordinary control over what your avatar will look like. From haircuts to details like your avatar's eye color, hairstyle, and facial hair, everything is under your control. It's worth remembering that you can even create longer hairstyles in Hytale Model Modelmaker, like the ones in the image. Regarding hair colors, in this image we see many colors, but from what we saw in the trailer, there will be much more than what is shown in the photo. And another important fact is that until the game launches, many more options can be added, our options will be enormous. The accessories will also have a very wide variety, as we saw in the trailer. Regardless of the hairstyle you choose, you can wear them. You can choose from hats, glasses, bandanas, scarves. In short, there is an infinite number of options waiting for us. As for the clothes, according to what was shown in the last update on customization, it seems that we will even be able to change the color of each piece of the look you choose. From the first image we have of the clothes to the last one released, it seems that there was a sophistication in the way of choosing clothes colors. Shirts can be worn under jackets. Another very important detail about the garment is the fluidity in long clothes like coats. They are animated as you move. When you equip new pieces of armor or other equipment, they are usually layered on top of the appearance you have set for your character. This provides an extra degree of creative freedom allowing you to mix and match outfits of different styles with the various levels of armor you'll create and collect in Adventure Mode. But if you think it's over here, you're wrong. The game's Adventure Mode will provide you with much more. This world of magic is reflected in the character customization. You'll be able to create a wide variety of fantasy avatars, from young explorers to grizzled veterans, farmers, magic users, and artisans. And if you have a hobby of dressing up as fictional characters from Japanese pop culture, the famous cosplay, know that it will be possible at Hytale. Server operators will be able to replace character appearances as you play on their servers, allowing creators to set themed looks for their minigames. For example, the operator of a Western-themed server might want everyone to wear period-appropriate clothing. This will definitely be amazing. Inspiration for customization options comes from many different sources. In Adventure Mode, the zones themselves have a huge influence on the types of clothing options players can receive. For example, in this image, we see a clothing style for Zone 2. This outfit was inspired by Ferrans and desert clothing. Ferrans wear handcuffs, so golden bracelets were added that cover their wrists and ankles. Zone 2 also has cacti that are very bright and colorful, so this was reflected in the clothing. Symbols are also important. There are a lot of symbols in the game, so it was also reflected in the clothing. Everything has a meaning. It was not done randomly. Customizing your character goes beyond the look. Hightail avatars can also show different facial expressions and perform gestures. Some of these occur during normal gameplay, grinding your teeth when swinging a sword, for example, while others are manually triggered. On the trailer itself, there is an icon that appears that we suspect is where this is done manually. Reworked the way Hightail handles color variations of game assets. This makes it much easier for modders to provide a set of expressive options for players to spruce themselves up. Let's explain how the new system works. A new system called Gradient Mapping has been implemented. This effectively divides any game asset into three components. The model, 
which determines the fundamental shape of the item. The texture, which can now incorporate grayscale areas to tell the game engine where to apply color variations. A color gradient file, selected from a shared set of files, that tells the game what color to apply to the designated area of the texture. In this image, we can see a simple t-shirt design with grayscale texture. Color taken from a separate gradient file is then applied to the mappable area, allowing us to create a wide variety of variations on a given item from a single base texture. It is possible to define the colors of certain parts of a texture and leave others customizable. In the example above, the green stripe on the tracksuit pants is a customizable area while the dark blue tone of the pants themselves is fixed in the texture file. Additionally, the gradient file properties can be used to define different types of materials, from thick fabrics to high contrast metallics and soft textures like hair. You will be able to create and apply textures with gradient mappable areas in Hightail Model Maker. You'll also be able to implement custom gradient maps, introducing new color schemes and materials to the high tail palette, and further expanding the range of options available for existing items. Remembering that in this video, we are bringing the personalization of his human character, of course. You will be able to choose from several other playable races for your high tail avatar, but there are not many details about these other races that we can choose from. We have reached the end of this journey. If you liked the video, like and comment just to let me know. If you will prefer to play with human characters or other races, share with your friends and see you next time, adventurers.